The move came about, you know, of course, like anything, as a person, you always strive to, you know, achieve stuff. Um, I just felt, you know, my time at City was getting um, limited on, on playing time um, for different reasons. And, you know, it's, it was not one that I could you know, afford to waste more time because, um, you know, when I look back in the future, I didn't ever wanted to look back and, you know, see a, a rising and a decline. So my thing was I need to, you know, keep that same level um, and a fresh challenge was, was to, to be made. You won so much at City though. How difficult a decision was it and what kind of conversations did you have with the club? Um, I said it's something that um, since 17, I've 17, yeah, been regular starting um, and then to get to the, I feel like, a, a peak time in my career. Um, not to, you know, be playing as regular, but something that I, you know, I wouldn't um, kind of accept. And, you know, I always try to, always, my personality is to try and fight and um, change the scenario, but it didn't, it couldn't, couldn't come and that was it. Of course, with the time that I spent at City, it's with a lot of memories, it's a lot of memories, a lot of top moments. Um, but I say the year, the year and a year and a bit that I was kind of in and out of the team, it taught me a lot about myself. It made me, um, you know, value um, a lot, a lot of things, and, and try to get things in order. And um, I said things. A lot of things happened for a reason, and you know, I, I kept with that mentality. And um, it was difficult, of course. Um, my kids go to school there. Um, my son now missing his friends, but again, it's those things in life that you know you have to make a decision that's best best for the, for yourself and of course for your your family. You know, at first, you know, with the few other options I had. It was more one that Taylor made for you know my personal goals, um, family. I think it it makes a lot lot of sense. And then you know of course with the club, the direction the club's going in, and you know you look at Chelsea in the last couple of years. I think it's four or five finals that they've been in. Um, it's a team that shows that they're competing, um, and they're only going to get better. So for me, you know with the the new ownership and the takeover, it it, it made a lot of sense. My uh, my full journey. Um, going up to Liverpool, manifesting what I wanted, um, then going to City, living the dream, and then now coming back to London as a, a grown adult and kind of been in in the football game a while, and you know, kind of feel like I've I've got my my head on my shoulders. I know exactly what I want from my life and football. So it's I think it's the perfect time to you know have a new challenge ahead of me.